so we are in the bed now um talking to my mom on facetime she always talks to the baby before he goes to bed so yep. um hey y'all and cody and the baby are right here okay pie eh. he has been fed so he's right on schedule so he'll be going to sleep within the next thir- not him swatting what that's because i went late yeah get him again put to say stop it daddy stop it daddy you don't tell me. You don't tell me, boy. You don't tell me, boy. Yeah, so Gigi's on the phone on FaceTime. Of course, I'm not going to put her on camera, but she's currently cleaning her ears. And um, she cleans her ears at least three times a day. <laughs> so there's that. Colin reaching for me. Kyle, good night. Thank you. In the arms of an angel. Y'all hear my mama talking in the background. Watch this. Kai, good night. Good night, Kai. My mom and my brother's ears used to be so clean, which I clean my ears too a lot, but not as much as them. But all of us essentially got pretty clean ears. But my doctor used to tell my brother his ears were too clean. Like, they're too clean. Like, you need something to catch the bacteria. And my mom would just be in there digging. She'd be talking, yeah, because I'm like... Get him, Poonas. Get him, Poonas. Get him, Poonas. Mm. Look at that face. Mm. Look at that face. That's the sweetest face I know. Ooh. Oh, y'all. We are finally getting ready to go to bed. And... Um, I got my outfit together, like I told y'all. And, um, yeah, so, love y'all. We'll see y'all in the morning. Bye. Mom, say bye. I ain't got you on camera. Just say bye. Say it again. Bye, bye. <laughs> All right, bye, y'all. Love y'all. We'll see y'all in the morning. Making me look pregnant, <laughs> and I am not Mom, pregnant. Look. I don't know, y'all. I don't know if this belt is necessary. Okay, I, I like better. the belt. Yeah, that's better like this. Okay. And All right. So now the next mission is the hair. We're definitely running behind. Uh, we actually. Our alarms went off at seven, seven oh five this morning, but we didn't actually get up to like seven thirty. So I'm assuming that we kept sleeping past the alarms. And eventually I realized it was 7.30. I was like, okay, we got to get up. Because the goal was to be out of the house by 8.15. And I still had to feed the baby, get him dressed, get myself dressed. So it's a lot. Um, Cody went outside to warm the car up. So, I'm going to at least try to throw my eyebrows on. So, anyway, good morning, y'all. We'll see y'all in a little bit.
Okay, y'all. So, obviously, I've arrived to work. Um, Cody had an appointment. And so, I am trying to find all of our bottles that have our disinfectant in it because we need to be able to disinfect. And I don't know where all of those bottles are and where they've been placed. Okay, I see one right there. All right, let me see. Okay, so that's one. Where is the others? I'm going to talk back with you all once I find everything I need to find. All right, y'all, I am getting ready to go down the hall to teach first grade. And here's Anna. So she's sitting with the baby because our students, our older students, are still doing their quiet centers right now, which are not so quiet. But, you know, as long as they stay quiet. I tell them to be quiet, and they whisper, so that's the best we can get. Mm. We have a short week because we didn't have school yesterday because of MLK Day. So, um, yeah, I'm about to head down the hall. And then when I come back, I'm going to be getting ready for um, teaching um, my second and my fourth grade. So, I'll see y'all when I get down there. Okay, y'all. So, we're sitting in class and we just, it's literally ice. Ice is falling from the sky. That is hilarious. What? That's ice. That is not right. Oh my god. You see it. Oh, no ice way. is literally falling from the sky. That's hilarious. This is the weirdest thing. It. It's ice. Yeah. I need ice in my hair. All right, y'all. Let's get back inside. Okay, it's cold, y'all. Come on this yeah, side. Come on. Come on. Please. I just get the ice. Come on before we get the nose. I was just listening. I was like, is that. Wait, can I see the ice? Can I see the ice cube, Levi? Oh, no. Not an ice cube. <laughs> he had no, an ice cube. It's not a cube, honey. No, Caleb has an ice cube. I want ice. Um, anyway. Okay, so I did not take you guys down there when I went to teach my first grade students because I forgot the camera, so I'll record myself doing more later. Miss Anna's about to start teaching. Have a seat. You just work on what you're supposed to be working on. All right, y'all. I was just down here in our office doing our office hours. So now I'm headed back to my classroom with the baby. Um, Anna's going to feed him while I teach English and reading to my fourth graders. I'm going to turn this hallway light off because it's almost time for nap time for our first graders and their room is on this hall so oh, carrying the baby oh he is heavy oh, let me turn this light off too oh, Okay, y'all, I don't know if y'all can see me because the sun is so bright right now. Um, and I literally can't see myself. But I am headed to my nail appointment. So, okay, there you go, focus. I'm headed to my nail appointment um, because I literally got my nails done before Christmas. And they look a hot mess. And then literally this one, it was like my nails knew I was getting them done today because two of them just broke. So, that's what I'm doing. I am starving, so I'm going to grab myself a quick little snack, if you will. And then from there, I'm going to go to my appointment. So, um, today's been a very, like, 
all over the place kind of day, but I think it's because we didn't have Monday and we just kind of jumped right into the day today. Um, and also today is my first day back, like doing like official, like how I was doing stuff before I left. Um, because last week was my first week back. It was also the students first week back. And so we didn't do like a lot of heavy teaching. We was just kind of getting them reacclimated re after the break. Um, so this week we're back in the swing of things and so I just got to get myself um, and we're also implementing our new hire who is now um, an intervention teacher who's pulling our students that may be struggling and working with them and so yeah it's it's a lot happening so anyway my stomach is touching my back I've not eaten anything all day like nothing so um I am going to grab some spring egg rolls from Panda Express because that's the quickest thing I can think of, some spring rolls, the veggie ones, and then head to my appointment. Okay, guys, so I'll see y'all in a little bit. All right, y'all, I'm here. I sat in the car and ate like two of my spring rolls, so I'm technically two minutes late, but it's all right. Um, I had to put some on my stomach. I have an appointment with Tom at 1.30. Tom, he is always good conversation, very great customer service, and he does really good nails. So we were just in there laughing about um, this uh, very like popular nail artist on um, Instagram that charges like sixty to seventy dollar per nail, um, which you can like if you follow his page, you'll see why he charges so much because he literally does like all these fancy designs. And it takes you probably three or four hours to get them done. Which, who's going to do that? But um, we were just laughing, talking about that anyway. But I am headed back to the school to pick up the boys. And I will see y'all in a little bit. Hey, y'all. Um, we are off work slash school. It's been a long day. Extremely long day. Uh, still got some more to do. A little bit more to do when I get back home, just making sure I'm in a good spot for tomorrow. Um, because I didn't really get to jump on till at till about 11. So, um, so yeah, the boys are Mommy. in the car. Y'all say hey, hi, hi. Kai is up here getting fed. Hey guys, I'm feeding the baby. <laughs> We're actually waiting for, um, we have a, a church member slash friend that, um, that helps us with our program and we're waiting on her to drop Question. something off to us. So, um, Question. the boys are being the boys at this moment, but we're waiting. We met her up here at our target, um, which is like a middle ground, middle meeting point for us. So. She's bringing something for us, and then... Can we try again, Mom? We're going to go home, and um, Cody has some work to finish up for the work day, and then we'll let y'all know what the plan is for the rest of the day. So, all right, guys. Mom. We'll see y'all later. Mommy. Mommy, can we... All right, y'all, so we finally made it home. Probably about an hour ago, but I was sitting in the car doing the premiere for our podcast. And, um, can I cut this light on? Um, then I started dozing off in the car. So, there's that. 
There's Cody. Hey, y'all. He's got the baby. So, so we're very irritated because um, we had to pay money today that we weren't expecting to pay because about a month ago, um, two, months ago. two months ago, we got pulled over. This was like the last week or the first, like the last week leading into December, we got pulled over by, um, um, I can't even talk straight. We got pulled over. Huh? Okay, I'm going to get him. We got pulled over by the police. Um, and you know how the police try to get their quota at the end of the month. And we didn't realize um, that our registration was suspended because we had a lapse in insurance. And we didn't realize we had a lapse in insurance because Cody signed up for the automatic withdrawal. Now, that was on us to not go back and check it. But when you got all this money coming out your account, sometimes you just... And that was right around the time where Kylan had just... We had just started getting back in the swing of things. I think Kylan was like barely a month old. So life was just life during that time. So yes, ultimately it's our fault. But like it was it was kind of aggravating because that, that also that day we had to fork out a lot of money to get our insurance back reinstated. So it was like a lot of money being spent that we just did not plan for. And I ain't talking about like no little bit of money either. So that was annoying um so we did that and then we thank god i have to give god praise at least we had the money to do it because there's been situations in our lives where that would have happened and we wouldn't have had any of the money to do it as a matter of fact it happened on november 29th to be exact no yeah november 29th and so anyway um Long story short, the police officer told us, she was like, the judge is pretty cool about stuff like this. Just let them know you got to reinstate it the same day. And um, it was a lapse, you know, just, you know, you guys um, had a mis made a mistake. You were under, because I mean, we confidently opened up that phone and was like, oh, we have insurance. Only to find out that it was not, it had not been taken out. So because it hadn't been taken out, they... Discon uh, what they do, disconnect it, or uh, they suspended our registration. So, Cody went to court today to handle that and show the judge, and he said, like, two people in front of him had the same situation, and theirs was dismissed. Well, we still had to pay. Now, granted, he knocked it down, he reduced the price, but we still had to pay, which was annoying because it was just kind of like, why you do that? So I'm like, you know what, Lord? You got something else for us. I'm not even going to worry about it. Because at this point, it's like little small things here and there. And I'm just like, Lord, I'm not even going to sweat it. I'm not even going to sweat it. So, But it kind of has had Cody in a funky mood today. Because it was he went down there and was down there much longer than he planned. So his work day got started late. And he was just frustrated and... Yeah, so if y'all see Cody kind of looking kind of out of it, that's why. And we're both really tired. Um, we had a, a fairly busy couple of days, and our weekend was pretty busy too. So we're gonna just chill out here. Um, it's possible we may be um, canceling school tomorrow because of the winter advisory. Um, Literally this morning, y'all saw on the vlog, it was literally raining ice. Or ice was falling from the sky. Sleet. A winter mix. Whatever they want to call it. Freezing rain. Freezing rain. I mean, it's just ice. So, anyway. I'm getting undressed for the day. And, um, yeah, so. <sighs> putting all my stuff up, so. Look at them. So I didn't even get we were we were rushing out of the morning this out of the house this morning. I didn't even get to make up the bed, and I do not play about that. I don't care how what's going on. I'm making up my bed, and 
I literally didn't have time because Cody had to be at the courthouse at 9. Only for him to get there and they were running behind and he said it was at full capacity. Ouch. So. Okay, pumpkin. Mama coming. I'm coming, stank bear. All right, y'all. Let me go tend to my baby. Y'all ever get home and fix your mouth for some leftovers or a snack of some sort that you have been waiting for all day or you get back to your room and you're like oh I wouldn't mind having that that's what just happened to me I was sitting back here and I was like oh I want my chips and my dip a snack that I asked for for myself so I asked Carter said babe can you bring warm me up some cheese dip because I was dealing with the baby and some dip chips and he was like oh I don't know if there's many left and I said of what now keep in mind he just got the chips yesterday and they were my snack these were my snacks and he said oh I ate some when I got home okay did you eat all of them no it's still some okay so you left crumbs in the bag vlog at all yesterday because the camera died on us and it was apparently charging all day but then when I got it to to film for my YouTube channel the battery was exhausted and I was like how did you charge all day and still not have battery so random question where, what does it say it is now full cool. okay and I put it on the um charger last night oh you did okay on the um portable one oh, okay I didn't wake up early. But anyway, you can focus on me. Anyway, we're headed to work, work slash, school. slash school slash work, <laughs> what we always say. Um, but um, it's been a, a very up and down, up and down kind of week. Like, honestly, it's been crazy. Um, a lot of emotions this week. Just a lot of emotions. Um... Cody had a rough day on Tuesday. Um, yeah. A really rough day on Tuesday. Monday was supposed to be a day of rest, but turned into, for me, turned into a day of multiple meetings. Um, yeah, it did. <laughs> it, it, it was yeah. a lot. Monday was rough for me. Tuesday was rough for Cody. Wednesday, which was yesterday, was probably... Busy. Huh? busy it was extremely busy but probably the less yeah, it less rough yeah. rough like it wasn't as emotional well i take that back it was emotional for me at towards the middle end of the day but at the like very tail end i was on the phone with hope my friend hope which y'all probably see her in the comment sections um we talked a lot yesterday and um something smells sour uh-oh Anyway, oh, ooh, ooh, that's it's fine. It's this. <laughs> Am I the only person that puts mail up in the visor after I check the mail? But anyway, no. I'm gonna put it on Cody because y'all probably can see him better. Y'all can see me. But um, I was talking to her yesterday, and <laughs> it just uh, we talked, and she was kind of talking me through my feelings, and then. I end up getting um, my order from Shein um, because I am doing a capsule wardrobe now. Kind of me and Cody are both doing it. So yeah. our clothes came in. So that was fun opening those up. And after opening those up and just playing around with the outfits and giggling and laughing with hope, it, it really made me feel a little bit better. And in typical Cody fashion, I'm wearing some of the clothes today because that's, that's just how I do See, but Tam, the thing about Tam that is hilarious to me is she will have, she'll pull out like a random dress or shirt or like pair of pants or whatever and be like, yeah, I haven't worn these yet. They still got a tag on them. Like, well, when'd you get them? Like three years ago. <laughs> like, what? It's not that bad. When I buy new clothes, I he wear wears them. them. He wears them. I That's take time to marinate on it and like figure out how I want to put it together. That's what I I get that from my brother though like he always taught me like don't bust out all your new clothes yet like 
hit them hit them slowly with the new clothes. You know what? Or I blend it or blend it in yeah. with some of the older clothes, so it looked like a whole different outfit when really it's an old shirt with new jeans. You, you see know, what I'm saying? You know, honestly, what I think it is though, for me, is I think if I got new clothes more often. Yeah. Then I probably would hold back, but the fact that I buy like or you buy me new clothes maybe once a year it feels like it's like okay I got I'm excited I got new clothes I'm gonna wear them but if I got like new, if I had like new new outfits once a month then I probably yeah. would wait to wear certain things you know what I mean and to but, be honest we could budget each month to get you like three or four new pieces yeah. until we fully build your wardrobe and same for me I still yeah. I just have a few more things I need to get uh, you need like you need more shoes and things I need like more that pants too. you need more pants but like if we could budget we could genuinely budget to do that and it would be it's not gonna be hard like yeah anyway so we are almost to church I've got my oatmeal you got the oatmeal right CJ, did you pick it up? Yeah, I still have it. Where is it in your hands? Yeah. Where, Where is, is it? it? Right next to it. Okay. Okay. But anyway, uh, we're almost there, so we'll see y'all in a little bit. Bye. Bye. All right, y'all. I've arrived to work, and I'm headed to make myself my oatmeal as well as Cody Jr. He wants some grits, so I'm going to. Uh -oh. I'm going to get those items. So, for our homeschool, we um, we make things like pancakes, like frozen pancakes, instant grits, instant oatmeal, stuff like that for them for breakfast. Um, and so, with us running a little behind today, Cody, Cody picks and chooses when he wants to eat breakfast at school. So. Sometimes I don't even bother to ask because some mornings he's like, oh, I don't want anything. And then some mornings he's starving, so you never know with him. Um, so, yeah. I'm making that. I like to add a little butter and sugar in my oatmeal, but, uh-oh. But for some reason, the butter in this fridge has like a garlicky smell to it, so I won't be putting that in my oatmeal. So I put it in his grits, but not in my oatmeal. I was trying not to touch it. That's what I'll do. The oatmeal is pretty sweet enough. It doesn't necessarily need. Um, sugar, but I'm just being extra. So. I'm gonna make Cody's grits, make my oatmeal, and then we'll be good to go.
to come out the door. Bye, this is what we do. Anna, say hi. Huh? Say hi to the vlog. I'm recording how our children be in here for real cows and instead of going outside. No, 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 no. It is impossible. Impossible. So we're on our way out the door from our work day. Oh Lord, y'all, I'm all over the place, and so is this vlog. <sighs> Alright. Cody doesn't know this, but I'm about to ask him to take me to get an acai bowl. Because I want one. You're still scared. Okay, y'all. Sorry about that. Alright, so we are in the car. And I'm so sleepy. Oh, I could just take a, a good nap right now, and I think I'm going to do that. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Um, so we've uh, it's been so much going on, y'all. I can't even begin to tell you like so much has taken place, to say the least. But um, we're headed in towards the end of the week. Next week is my birthday, and so yeah, just trying to figure some things out. So yeah. In two weeks, it'll be Brinson's birthday, right, Mom? Huh? Carson, stop touching my cat. Oh, I'm so tired. Anyway, I love you guys. We'll see you on a little bit. Step back so they can see your outfit. Step all the way back. Fresh today, honey. Okay, I'll see you now. I just want to tell you quick story, vlog people. Um, vlog people. Vlog people. I just want to tell y'all, I trust my wife. Well, I would Let me elaborate on that because this is awkward. So, th awkward? this shirt being open and me every couple seconds, I gotta fix it because it's out like this. Like, it's annoying. But. I've gotten like five compliments today. Mama. Um, because even Alexis was like, I like that outfit. It's like, Mommy. all right, Tam. <laughs> Mom, all right. So it's like, I trust, I trust my wife because this, this is taking some getting used to. I'll just say that. But it looks good. Thank you. But from, from, that's the. And that the car sparse. The Carson, you better boys. grab it two hands. Strawberry. Right. What do you say? Thank, Thank you. you. And babe, I just, I just want you to answer this question because I already know you know the answer. What? Which one did I get? Beach bone with dark chocolate. Every time. And I got a new bowl, so I didn't get the acai bowl, but I got the green one. What are you recording, babe? Well, I was recording you. You sleepy. Turn the camera so around, sleepy. baby. Turn the camera around. I got this one. So this was the green dream bowl. And I you know, you have this one. Tomorrow is so good. Are you talking about People oh, okay, see me, but they just don't know. I got it without the honey because sometimes the honey be tasting weird. I got coconut. It's got coconut, mangoes, chia seeds, blueberries. And then this part blended at the bottom with avocado, lime, and something else. Some Greek yogurt or something. So, that's what I'm about to eat. Hey, y'all. I am going in the store. As y'all can see, I am picking up stuff for dinner. And then we're headed back home. Because a lot of work has to be done. So, <sighs> so come with me in the store. beef so I'm gonna have to get that from Walmart but 
couple more things and we're out of here. I got three videos to edit today so y'all yeah, pray for your boy a lot of work to do but we'll be all right we are pulling into the house like I said I didn't vlog in Walmart because that took two seconds I know that's the thing about going to the store you go to all the time versus a new store like I had to look up stuff in the Publix app to see what outlet was on because I'm not used to that Publix but I knew exactly what all that stuff was on in Walmart I feel like we live in there I feel like I'm in there once a day. <laughs> you are. <laughs> I feel like I'm in there once a day. Because if it ain't getting stuff for dinner, it's Tam already got stuff at the house for dinner, but she need one ingredient that she missing. <laughs> and then she sent me across the street. Babe, can you go get some some chicken broth? Uh, Babe, can you go get a pack of ranch seasoning? <laughs> Babe, as a matter of fact, I'm just craving salmon. Can you get a pack of salmon from across the street? Like, story of my life. But anyway, we just made it home, right? Right, boys? Ooh, they upset with me. I said we just made it home. All right, boys? I said right, boys? Yes. I just said right, boys, this time. Babe, them, babe, them jokers mad at me. Like and look, Tam looks sleepy, sleepy. I'm glad I have energy. Now, I won't guarantee I'm going to have energy this evening, but I got it right now. So, bless the Lord for that. But we about to go in the house. I'm going to sit in the car with the baby while you take the groceries and stuff in, and then you can come back out. And then it's going to take me two and a half. I'm, it's going to take me two and a half seconds to do that. I'm going to grab the groceries and Kai. <laughs> it's a lot. It's two bags. Push hard and pull. It's the bag from Walmart and the bag from Publix. Oh, anyway. Alright, y'all. We are home. Right, babe? Ooh, she's sleepy. <laughs> that thing hurt. That thing hurt my ears. Oh, I have editing to do. Which hopefully goes by quicker um then i'm anticipating um but yeah so i'm about to do that in bay because i'm also editing this do you want to close this out okay yes show the baby i don't know that we showed the baby at all during this vlog oh yeah i don't know if we have either so we can end it off showing the little punka dunka bunka dunka wunka stunka punka i don't know who that is FYI. <laughs> but he is on. Oh, hold on, y'all. Well, oh, he sleeping slash waking up. That's a baby boy. That's a baby. Y'all, he um I was in a meeting with my director for work today and he woke up, he was with me, he woke up in the middle of it. <laughs> I'm glad I'm in a job where it's not only flexible, but they Daddy. are really understanding of stuff like that. Because we're all kind of in the same place on the same level. But, um, yeah, he was, I mean, crying, crying. Not no little bitty tears. He was getting it. But, anyway. So, guys, we're going to end this here. You got something to say, Siege? Bye. I guess he had nothing to say. Bye. We didn't say bye.
Anyway, we're going to end it here, right, babe? Mm, yeah. Yes, we're going to end it here. And, yeah, so. We love y'all. Are we twinning just a little bit today? A little bit. Oh. Hello. All right, we love y'all. We'll see y'all in the next one. Bye. Bye.